Israeli forces shoot dead 10-year-old Palestinian boy near Nablus. Israeli forces shot and killed a 10-year-old Palestinian boy in the northern occupied West Bank yesterday. Mohammed Ibrahim Fait Bala, 10, was shot in the chest by an Israeli soldier around 6.30 p.m. on 23 November in the Palestinian town of Batah, located south of Nablus in the northern occupied West Bank, according to documentation collected by Defense for Children International, Palestine. Mohammed sustained a gunshot wound to the chest during an Israeli military incursion as Israeli forces began to withdraw from Batah. He was alert and conscious and transported by car to a nearby health center where it was clear he was seriously injured. An ambulance brought him to Al-Najjar Medical Hospital in Nablus where he died around 8 p.m. Palestinian children continue to bear the brunt of the Israeli military's shoot-to-kill policy, said Aid Abu Ektaish, Accountability Program Director at SIP. Israeli forces roam the occupied West Bank knowing they can kill any Palestinian with complete impunity, including children like 10-year-old Mohammed. Israeli forces entered Batar around 6 p.m. on Thursday searching homes in the western part of the town. Palestinian residents confronted Israeli forces as they withdrew toward the Adla Junction, chasing and throwing stones at two military jeeps and a personnel carrier. Mohammed was sitting behind a building under construction off the main road as the Israeli military vehicles passed by and traveled about 200 meters, 656 feet, down the street. He stood up to walk toward the street thinking the military operation had ended. Then, an Israeli military vehicle stopped nearby and an Israeli soldier opened fire from inside the vehicle. Everyone ran, including Mohammed, and he realized he was injured. 56 Palestinian children have been killed in the occupied West Bank since October 7, according to documentation collected by Tzip, when the Israeli military began a full-scale military offensive on the Gaza Strip dubbed Operation Iron Swords. So far this year, Israeli forces and settlers have killed at least 96 Palestinian children in the occupied West Bank, according to documentation collected by Tzip. Israeli forces and settlers shot and killed 82 Palestinian children with live ammunition, nine Palestinian children were killed in drone strikes, four Palestinian children were killed by missiles fired from AU.S, sourced a Pash attack helicopter, and one child was killed in an Israeli warplane airstrike. At least 211 Palestinians have been killed by Israeli forces and settlers in the occupied West Bank since October 7, according to the UN Office for the Coordination of Humanitarian Affairs. Under international law, intentional lethal force is only justified in circumstances where a direct threat to life or of serious injury is present. However, investigations and evidence collected by TSIP regularly suggest that Israeli forces use lethal force against Palestinian children in circumstances that may amount to extrajudicial or willful killings.